Press F2 in game to see a live preview of the warm up around your town. Press F7 to see your ping and FPS. Use F11 to deploy, it only takes 10 seconds, you will not earn a death and the resource you used will return. However, the vehicle you spawned with will not return and you will learn the usual cooldown. I often use this to get back on the plane as a paratrooper to skip walking through the woods, to go back to defend O1 immediately because I'm far away, or if I got bored playing recon then I want to confuse the enemy players that are looking for me to kill me and waste their time. You can still chat, place orders and change settings but anything else will cancel it. Hover your mouse on top of the enemy spawns to reveal the assault teams that are attacking from that line. If you go prone and you can't use your bandage, try moving around a little bit. If you press escape or enter while holding down any button, it will remain toggled. Use that to free your hand while repairing, sprinting, driving, swimming or anything else. Press space to automatically adjust the elevation with any weapon or tank. It takes around 2 minutes for an anti-air to respawn. Keep that in mind if you are a pilot. Press A or D to get off a ladder sideways. There are three symbols for when spotting enemies. If you are not sure where they are placed, open your map to check. Click here to change the colors for each faction on the Generals tab. You can send a private message to someone in game by following this format. There is an option for you to have the map on your hand if you don't like it when it's full screen. You can easily jump through windows if you crouch after you jump. Simply press and hold control after you jump. You can simply shoot any fence to break it if you get stuck. What the fuck? Or you can just punch him down with a melee weapon like Minecraft. Try to reserve your energy before engaging in fights. If you're exhausted, the sway and recoil of any weapon will be harder to control. You can use control to pick cover with your machine gun after you mount it. Do this to avoid accidentally shooting at your own cover or to get a better angle. If you run out of ammo, you will automatically crouch down while the bipod remains in place. Your medic symbol goes away once you are on your last bandage, so don't feel awkward when teammates with low health look at you. Just hide it in your pocket and they won't know you have one. Or you can just heal them, you know. If you are grinding to buy veteran membership with credits, remember to go back to your most profitable battle to buy your veteran from there. You will gain a nice credits kickstart from claiming the bonus. It doesn't matter which line you spawned from as an attacker, you can always capture or defend other objectives as well. If you do this smart enough, you can skip capturing some objectives from your line or saving others by capturing 01 or 02. If the attackers manage to capture an objective after 20 minutes or more, they will be rewarded with 2 extra minutes. Here you can see an example where the match was about to end, but because the enemies managed to capture an objective after 20 minutes of failing, they got rewarded with 2 more minutes only to fail again. You can press F3 to see how you earned your most recent XP. This can be useful if you forgot what parts of the enemy tank you damaged or if you want to check if the sniper you just killed was the one your teammates were complaining about in the chat. You can hide the objective icon and other indicators when aiming. Simply go to the interface options to change it or check my other video to learn how to do it properly.